Hey, what's going on? Welcome to my first very real game review. <laughs> and today we're going to check out 1999 Batman on the original Game Boy. Oh my god. I loved this when I was a kid. I was eight years old. That, that's, that tells you how old I am right now. <laughs> but anyway, every, everything about this game is just awesome. I loved it as a kid. Especially playing with the green and black kind of background and your mom's telling you to go to bed and you're just like sitting there you're going oh, mom I just want to play a little bit more and and then you got the every attachment for the Game Boy that there was like um, uh, the the magnifying glass with the light so you can actually play in the dark and it sucked up like 16 batteries and then two hour time <laughs> but uh, yeah I, I love this game growing up it was like one of my favorites um, now, as an adult, you kind of go, uh, wait a second, why does Batman have a gun? <laughs> Just like in the NES uh, version, you know, Batman has this gun, and, um, it, it just, it blows my mind every time I play it. But, um, yeah, this, this very much is like, uh, a shoom theme, like, you don't have, a, like, a punch and a kick, you just have your gun, or, uh, whatever you want to call it now. I, I, I don't like using the word gun in Batman. <laughs> but uh, you, you get these cool power-ups for it. You get like a wavy kind of uh, pulse. Um, and then you you got these little bat things. <clears throat> and they kind of work as your shield. Now you can get four of them at a time, which is really, really cool. Um, and they they do hurt the, the enemy, which is nice. So if you're like trapped and uh, you can't shoot them with with uh, the gun uh, you, all you really have to do is just lean against the edge and just lift the batarang and just do it, do its job but um, yeah so four um, so four little uh, batarang see just keeps adding up and it keeps spinning faster and faster which is really cool um, yeah that was the first stage that, that, that didn't take long at all now the little cinematics are pretty good, especially for the Game Boy days, they look pretty good. Um, next one up is going to be a flying stage in the Bat Wing, or Bat whatever, Bat, bat Plane? Bat Wing? I think it's a Bat Wing. Now this one is the same kind of thing, you get you get power-ups. Um, I love this stage, I never really got past this uh, first, I think it was the first or second uh, flying mission, I never really got past as a kid, only because it was like insanely hard. Um, now this does follow basically the story of the movie, uh, you know, take some liberties, like, <laughs> Batman did not have to kill his, this many planes in the movie, but, um, yeah, you deal with the Joker, um, the Joker's gang, I, I, you don't really see Vicky Vale, she is not in this game at all, but it was nice to see that they kind of did, um, Jack Nicholson's Joker up pretty good in this, uh, it's kind of weird seeing Batman so small, you know, compared to everything else in the game. But, uh, I'll shut up for a second. The music in this is just awesome. I love the music. I love everything that they did in this game, especially for 1990, on a on a system that was basically new. Like there wasn't any really handheld games or handheld consoles out there. This was like the first of its kind, and the way that they did it was just was spectacular. I loved it. <clears throat> um, yeah. <laughs> this is the last level. This is... Look how big the Joker is compared to you. Like, are you... Like, seriously? And there's one of the other specials. It's like the Batarang, uh, Boomerang kind of thing. You know, Joker's not that hard to beat. It's just a pattern. You gotta memorize the pattern. But I, it's like Batman's so freaking small. There he goes, he's dead. It doesn't take much. A little cutscene. Very cool. I love it. Yeah, so guys, um, if, if you have, you know, if you can find us out, out and about 
And if you have an original Game Boy, this is one game that you probably would love to pick up. Um, I, I love it. Uh, I especially love the Batman uh, NES, uh, which was just like a Ninja Gaiden kind of cross, and it was just awesome. I loved it. The little, the, the little movements of this game, that's awesome. There, right there. But anyway, guys, uh, let me know what you guys thought about this. Uh, did you guys want me to do more game theme stuff for my channel? Um, I'm finally figuring out how to do shit on this editing software. Um, yeah, I'm trying to branch out here. I'm trying to get other things on this channel. Try to make it grow. Uh, you know, try to keep you guys entertained. But anyway, guys, uh, that's it for today's video. I might do another one. I know I'm going out to the comic book store today, so you guys should be expecting, uh, maybe a mystery comic haul. Um, I haven't done one of those in a while. Um, maybe I just might do a random just comic haul. Just boring comic haul. <laughs> but anyway, guys, that's it for today's video. I love you. And uh, if you have not yet subscribed, please do. Throw me a like, throw me a comment, and I will talk to you later.